to In the Spotlight. I'm your host and producer, Courtney Leonard May, and I'm here for you because I'm here to put you in the spotlight. Welcome back to In the Spotlight. I'm so excited, and I know you guys are excited too. You guys are ready for a great year of fun. No COVID. Yes. <laughs> so I have a great show for you guys today. Today I have clips of us out at Seafood Soul Fest on July 3rd, 2021. I interviewed some people out there and I want to throw that in the show. So go ahead and enjoy those interviews and a little bit of performances from a few people. Hey, this is your girl Courtney Lair May out here at the Soul Fest on July 3rd, 2021. And I'm out here with Nate. How you doing, Nate? I'm doing fine. Cool. So what brought you out here to the fest? Enjoy the weather and enjoy everybody out here and get out the house. Of course. Yeah, everyone wants to get out the house after that quarantine, huh? Yeah. And we need that. We need that. We need more of this. And I hope we get a lot more like this and get on out here and have a nice time and enjoy ourselves. So who have you seen get up on the stage so far? I've seen a little bit of everybody. I've been on both sides. So and uh, now I just came over here for the big concert. So you know that. <laughs> yeah, of course. How are you doing in that stage? That's it. I'm just me here with my family and all everybody right here. My, my wife, my sister, my sister-in-law, my cousin. And that's it. All right. Cool. Well, thank you so much for being in the spotlight. You. You have a good day. You too. See ya. You make me smile.
20 years, Tony and I started the group, um, and we, just, we, just, we got he new members, and we just been keeping it rolling. Mr. Lord Tony, he's our leader, he you know. Right here, yeah, these, these, these brothers right, right here, right, right. these brothers right yeah. here put the icing on the cake. Yeah. Let me read what it says right here, they all say the same yeah. thing. We know there's a market for our school, and for a lot of the elder, the older, the older crowd. Community. You know, we we like to provide them entertainment so they can come out and we give them a good show. In the name for and, and for the people that don't Mr. know us, this is Mr. Bobby Brown. This is everybody know Lord Tony. This is Jimmy McDean, and I'm Big B. We known as your Sacramento you know, Faux D. Yes, you guys got to get to know the Faux Deep. They keep so old school out, alive out here. It brings tears so, what does Juneteenth mean to you? My kids. Well, to me, Never to me it means. Uh, Amen. Never smoke. It's a celebration. Yeah. It's, it's a celebration for sure. But, <laughs> it, it, but I'm proud. Uh, it was a time when a lot of our forefathers, you know what I'm saying, <laughs> had come out of bondage. Check, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Back then, oh, we come out of bondage. Son, We're still fighting that same type of bondage, but it's just on another level. It's just on another level, but Juneteenth recognizes the struggle from then okay. till and now. Then I, and daughter, quite frankly, I know that the president made it a legal holiday, she makes all but the no, no disrespect Google. to anybody, but we gonna celebrate so Juneteenth anyway. It, it, it didn't need to be, it didn't need to be legalized. We gonna celebrate our heritage, our culture, and it's appreciated that it, it, it's For recognized by know, the government and I by the president, but we do this because we are strong people and that we want the world to know. That we are strong. So, yes, exactly. I'm we definitely have been celebrating Juneteenth for years. Manager. You know, and, uh, back in the day, just like you guys been in the old shows. school, we've been so doing it, you, I guess, Warren. since I we all been alive. <laughs> yeah. yeah. All right. So you guys, thank you so much for being on okay. in the spotlight on Jesus TV. All right, you guys, keep the music alive and you know, keep us gigging. All right. One other thing we need to mention: where's uh, 
working hard. Oh yeah, where can we find you guys out at next? Spot on Lounge. We'll be performing at the Spot on Lounge on the 24th of July. Uh, huh? Yeah. So yeah, the Spot on Lounge, the 24th of July. Uh, doors open at eight. You know what I'm saying? And you can you can get you can contact me at 916-410-6032 or. Two seven nine one six two seven one 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 four seven, and that's where you can see a full, full deep show. We're going to give you a full show. One thing I've always said is an entertainer, one person can entertain you, but a group can give you a show, and that's what we're going to do. Yeah, cool. Thank you so much for giving us a show today. All right, you guys. <laughs>
Courtney Lair, man. I'm out here with a powerful singer, you guys. I got Nisi right here. She's got a really strong voice. She did a great job on that stage, you guys. So how are you doing? I'm doing good. And where are you from? I'm from the San Francisco Bay Area, but I grew up in Richmond, California, just about 25 minutes out of San Francisco. All right, shout out to the Bay Area. And um, so when did you start singing? Oh, since I was two years old in church. <laughs> All right, so you're singing in the choir? Yep, choir. Uh, my son in the band at school. So just in any way with music, me she living single was there. <laughs> All right, girl, go ahead. So um, so you were singing lead. I know you got lead, huh? All the time. Yes. Yeah, lead. Yes, yes. All the time. Even when I said, let me do the background. No, we're gonna put you in the front. You gotta do it. Gotta do it. <laughs> And soprano. Yes. <laughs> Hitting those high notes, y'all. <laughs> so, um, how are you enjoying your day so far? I'm having an awesome time here. I want to thank Rick Warren for having me out here. Kenneth Hall introduced me on. Um, and I love San Francisco, uh, Sacramento. Uh, Sacramento is one of my spots that I love to come and perform in. So I'm just honored to be here. To be here to open for Howard here at Mission Bay and Peter Escobedo. How grand can it get? You know? Yeah, that's awesome. And where can we find you at next? Next show will be at Yoshi's. Uh, that's 510 in Barcadero in Oakland, right off of Jack London Square. My show is August the 5th. And my name is Nisi Living Single. You can find me on all social media. Nisi Living Single. That's N I E C E Y Living Single. And you can also find my CD titled Seven on all social networks. Music uh, networks. Google. Just Google Nisi Living Single, and you'll find me. Alright you guys, make sure you check out Nisi Living Single. She out here. Yeah. Just put her in the spotlight. Alright, alright. See you later. Bam. And remember to always be uniquely, beautifully you. See you later. Stay tuned for more in the spotlight. Today I Coming have up to on the next in the spotlight with Courtney. So fast. We have I'm out here with R and B singer and pop singer Lily. How are you doing today? Arlington Music Production. Yeah. I'm out here with R&B diva Sharonda G, and she just did her yeah. thing. Stay tuned. It's airing soon to a TV or device near you. Thank you all for watching.